physical again. And reading has become a coping mechanism for my grief. A, a pretty healthy one, I'd like to say. Um, my goal is to read 100 books by the end of the year. I am currently in book number 11. And I bought a reading journal. This is uh, by the, a clockwork reader. That's her channel name. A clockwork reader. Uh, she made this journal. She sells it on Amazon.
understand what they're talking about when they say that. I haven't read this yet, but um, because I don't want to waste my money on three books that I might hate, I decided to buy it. I mean, check it out at the library. Um, so this is my next read, actually. My current read is this. Oh, that was my chair. I'm sorry. Please ignore that. Um, it's current. It's this one right here. Aristotle.
next to it. Um, okay, actually, you can judge myself a little bit. I judge myself a little bit, too. I have the full quartet. I guess that's what you'd call it. Of Twilight. All four books, baby. Um, I bought three of them. I bought, okay, I bought Twilight, Eclipse, and Breaking Dawn. in just a pristine condition. And the reason that I normally wouldn't buy, I know that these books are bad, okay? And I normally wouldn't buy books that I know are bad um, all in one go. But in a few weeks, I think, um, Stephanie Mayers is releasing new covers for the Twilight books, and these are, these are like old, and I like them. And I, I don't really like the new style of book that's coming. So I was like, I gotta get my hands on so that they're not mismatched and I did that about the last two a few days ago and I know that the books are bad but I am reading them for the culture okay I am reading them for the culture I love the Twilight movies and I hated them when I first started watching it because the first movie is cringy I know it's bad but it is just so comforting to me and I, I know that like Edward and Jacob ruined Bella's life Teen Alice all the way It's so, it's so, just read that book. Um, but it was, again, the language was a little bit difficult to read. As expected. So, guilty pleasure books are there for my, my brain to relax, for me to not have to work so hard to understand things. Twilight is a perfect example of a guilty pleasure book. So, moving on, moving on, moving on. <laughs> Where am I going to put this? There's so many.
good girl's guide to murder. Um, so I feel like that's what I'm doing about good that book that will be. Hopefully, I like it um, because I hate hating books. I'm not the type of person that uh, DNFs anything. I do not DNF books. Um, so I, I'm really betting on the fact that I will like what I read. This is under.
was so young when I saw it. I don't know why my parents took me to see that. Like, like when the ship like sinks, I literally was having a physical breakdown in the movie theater. I was like, what the heck? I was so upset because all the animals, like, you, you gotta, um, but I knew that one day I would read the book. Like, I've just known that for years, and I saw it at Apprice Books, so I took it home with me. This is Winter of the
Six Star.